Hello everyone, welcome back to America Truck Subletter. So today guys, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're not going to be hauling um, nothing. We're actually going to be checking out this really cool little mod that I've seen. Uh, I've seen a lot of them. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get those mirrors off. I've seen a lot of uh, YouTubers use it. Uh, we, we're going to need that um, map. Um, so we're going to get in and take a look at it. Now this is a mod for a Ford F-350 uh, 84 model. And we've got a gooseneck trailer here. Now, we're not going to haul anything. We're just going to kind of travel in this truck. Uh, take a little road road trip with it. Uh, we're going to pick somewhere on the map to go. And uh, just have a good time. Just uh, drive and talk. Um, it won't be too far. You know, just kind of get out and uh, take a little ride. So let's see where we want to go today in this truck. All right. So we are in Salt Lake City. We could go. You want to go down to Denver? Let's see how far is Denver. Denver is 588 miles. So we we'll just go up to Denver for right now. That's about 500 miles. So. So we'll show you the interior of the truck. Here's your interior for this uh, old Ford truck. Looks really good. Really well done mod. Really like it. And it, it, it comes with. hit the road. Don't you get no crumbs on my back seat? It has three engine options. It has um, multiple tire options. Um, the trailer. I don't think you really did do to the trailer is paint it and change the rims. I tried to find some white rims that would go along, but I really couldn't find anything that I thought would go along with the truck. So let's go on route. We'll get a thumbnail. That's an end way. So we'll go over there. We're good on fuel. That's another end way. But well, we're going at it. Yeah, I mean, it, it's done very well. I'm, uh,. Really impressed with this uh, mod. Keep left, and then turn left. The sounds turn are done left. very well. map is not moving for some reason. Why is it? Recomputing. Hold on, let me let me figure out what's going on with the map. Put the brake on. Okay. We can turn around. Map wasn't moving for some reason. Okay. Then we'll just go this way. Oh. We're trying to turn around here. Oh, we don't want to do that. Damage the trailer. We'll turn around over here. It's not letting us turn around over there, so we'll just turn around right here. That's fine. Nice little ride. This is actually something that I've been really wanting to get into, but I haven't seen a really a, a car mod that has the handling that this one has. This one actually has really good handling. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. We turned the wrong way. Rowdy. Yep. We're gonna turn around again. When possible, make a U-turn. We'll get it right here in just a minute. Keep 
keep left and then turn left. Never mind, sugar. I'll find us a new route. Keep right, and then, you know it, continue straight on. Go straight on. That's right. We're just uh, not doing good with this uh, story ride today, are we? That's okay. He can handle it. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. It's this map. Alright. I like my map like that. I can see it better. Get ready to turn right. Now we're on the right track. Get up, get this on the road here. Test out this old F-350. I can say it does sound good, but the engine sounds are really, really good. bit to get it situated but we're on the road now Go ahead and get a thumbnail. We're gonna need a thumbnail. There we go. bit of lag. I have to figure out where that's coming from. Yeah, real, really well done, truck mod. Yeah, it's that's bad. I do apologize for the lag. 
It could be because I'm uploading videos. I'm not sure. I would definitely look at that and see if I can... On this profile, there's not many mods on, so I don't know exactly where that's coming from. It actually drives really well. I've used some of these models before with these cars, and they drove very. I mean, because I use controllers, so the driving form, the physics was terrible. This is actually driving really, really good. I don't know why it's lagging like that. All I can think of is, uh, okay. We don't even have nothing on there and they want us to wait. Okay. But I can think of the reason why it's doing it is because of, uh, it's uploading the videos. Okay. Let's find a new rail. We'll go across scale. I don't know why it's wanting us to, but we will. Twenty-three thousand five hundred sixty-four pounds. We've got 485 miles to go.
cruise control on. I don't think it had cruise control in real life, but you know. It's so different uh, driving something like this in this game. Eighty. Let's see if we can get it up to eighty. Ah, uh, that's bad. I, I'm sorry about the lag. Get some night driving in. Springs. Hey guys, I did remove the coast to coast map. I would run the coast to coast and the um, Canada map. I removed it because it it just wasn't realistic compared to what SCS does. And I understand that it is a mod, and this is bad. so bad. I keep left there. But it, it's it's not as realistic as uh, like what SCS does. And I understand that it has a mod and it's a modder that does it, but I just uh, don't particularly care to use it uh, that much. I guess you could say. I just, uh, I, I'll be really happy to see when SCS does get a little bit farther with the arm. And what, we, and what we have coming this year is going to be a big difference. Uh, if it comes this year, um, Texas may not come out this year. You know, we, we don't know.
can do that too, but we're in a car. Speeding. This is the crash, I believe. I keep left there. It's so bad, I don't know why it's like that. What's causing it? Also, guys, I want to say too that um, the channel, as you know, there hasn't really been nothing on the channel. Um, LSPDFR has been giving me a lot of problems. I've been trying to get it put back together. I've had to reinstall it like six times, and it still was giving me problems. Well, Rockstar updated GTA 5 again, uh, so now we're waiting on mods to update that you need to run. Without mods, uh, it won't uh, work. You gotta have script hook, and well, it, it'll work without script hook, but like your trainer and, um, and it, like you need your, you need a trainer to run real cars. You, you need a, and, uh, you need to, uh, to have real model cars and your trainer. ELS lighting for the cars, so there's a lot script hook does so you need if you're going to use it. truck horn.
we're going to pull up the map here just for me. I want to see exactly where we're going to go here in Denver. Uh, we just get, we'll go into this Walmart parking lot area right here. Let's just go ahead and end that. Yeah, we'll just go to that Walmart right there. Okay, here we go. Make sure you put your seatbelt on now. I'm about to figure out what's called the new. I'm not looking to it. See, that's bad. I don't think that has anything to do with it. Uploading video. It may. It, it might. Oh, yeah. night drive. Two hundred and three miles ago. Being quiet, letting y'all hear the uh, sound of this Ford V8, this old Ford truck. Um, like I said, I do apologize for the lag. I don't know what, what's going on with the lag. Maybe these lights, I, I don't know. Keep 
keep right and then exit right. Exit right. You can actually haul freight with this. I haven't tried it. Uh, I don't know if it will let you actually haul anything. It's, it is still a pretty cool mod. I, I do like it. It's done very well. past the way station. We got 77 miles to go.
We're in Denver. Well, we burnt about a half tank of fuel going up here. <laughs> Which would probably be legit for this truck, I'll, I'll be honest with you. There's another trailer sitting here. Okay. You know, I didn't notice that. You make it haul stuff on this truck. That'd be pretty cool. We could do that one day with it. I'm gonna pull right over here. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video using this uh, F-350, the older F-350. Um, 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to look into that. You make it haul freight with this truck. I, ha I have not figured that part out yet, so I will have to look into it and see if that actually that, that can be done. Uh, I'm gonna show you the customization for this truck. It's too bad at night. Um, but yeah, I'm going to uh, truck dealership mods. Go to Ford. F-350, customization. Alright, so. Alright, so you have one cab. One chassis. You have three engines. You have a Ford 6.9. Then you have a Ford 6.9. This is a 170, is what I said in this one. And this is a uh, Cummins 12 speed, so... We're running the Ford engine. You have um, four transmissions, automatic, three-speed, four-speed manual, five-speed manual, six-speed manual. A uh, cab options here for the interior is you have tan, red, gray, and blue. You have uh, the basic colors here: uh, orange, red, black blue you have white gray like that and then you have you have multiple options here um it's your bumper you have a painted bumper you can uh, paint a bumper it takes the rubber the guards off it's just a chrome bumper you can make the uh, grill painted if you want to make it stock uh, tire options you have a um, like four uh, four tire options here uh, rims you have three well I'm guessing you could also run these steelies here the steel and the steel wheels here too for it also and then uh, exhaust you have the uh, exhaust dumping out of the side like what we have the um, shotgun pipes, you have dual pipes, and just one regular pipe. This is probably up under the truck. Yes, right here. Um, so you have that. Interior on the inside, you, you have the just plain basic steering wheel. That's pretty much it, I believe. Yeah, that's your interior. Also, if you can go back out here to the back, show you this back here. You have an um, option here for a box, two box, two box with a rack, or just a rack. So, quite a bit of options on the truck. Um, actually, pretty cool little, pretty cool mod. I want to look at it real quick just to see, because I haven't looked at that. I didn't know you could do that, so... You can haul stuff with it. That's pretty neat that they got it set up to do that. We wouldn't get much in it, but I mean, you can do that. So, we'll have to do that one day. That would be pretty cool. I don't know why it's so bad right now. Um, but that's gonna be it for the day video guys. I want to thank you for everyone been watching the video that wasn't been subscribing and thank you and have a good day